It's time now for Better Weekends. The sniffling Renee Danino of the River 105.9 is here with the top movies and some of the fun things you can do this weekend. You want, want to check out. Nice to see you. Well, nice to see you guys. And thanks to your uh, weather report, I think everything I'm going to do is going to be inside. <laughs> it is really It good. is cold, cold outside, today. baby. All right. First and foremost, it is Free Movie Friday. We're going to continue on okay. for 2019. Every Friday, we want to give you free movie passes from our friends at the Adam Tickets app. You can browse movie titles, tickets, pre-order concessions, all from your phone. So right now... Go ahead and text the keyword STUNNING to A-T-O-M and the number one for your chance to win free movie passes. I think it's so nice to use an adjective yes. that describes me to text in for free. STUNNING. Well, we were trying to figure out what word to use, and that's what, that's and that's what, what you wanted to do. That. Okay, Thanks. so we're getting now to the top three movies at okay. the box office. Yes, so this week in the movies to be coming in at number three, Mary Poppins Returns, bringing Loved in, uh, yeah, last you saw weekend. It? Yeah. Was it good? It was really good. Did yeah. you really? And, and, and they and say Dick, Dick Van, Van Dyke. Dyke. Yes. Dick Van Dyke dances on a table. Don't want to ruin it for Unbelievable. Right. That brought in <laughs> a little over $15.8 million. Coming in at number two, Escape Room, making over $18 million. That was a surprise. That was a movie they didn't think was going to do as good, but apparently people like that kind of stuff. Uh. And the top movie of the week and the movie to beat is Aquaman, the superhero film, still in the top spot. Last weekend, it made over $30 million. Globally, at this point, it's taken in over $940 oh. million. <laughs> dollars. Oh, oh. This is the highest grossing DC movie of all time. Isn't that incredible? So much buzz about it coming million. out. Too. I do believe Jason Momoa may play a part in that. My mom wants to see the movie, has no idea about comic books. She's like, who's She's that? Like, who's Aquaman? Who? <laughs> so I think a lot of that is there. Anyway, um, we have a lot of movies to mention this week. The, the, I have my top three pick. What, one movie I want to talk about is getting a lot of mention, of course. It's on the basis of sex starring Felicity Jones as, uh, you know, Ruth Bader Ginsburg. So that is opening nationally this weekend. I would like to see that movie. Mm -hmm. It looks really good. All right, here's who I think is going to uh, give Aquaman a run for his money at uh, the box office this weekend. Let's start with my number one pick, Tissues Ready, A Dog's Way Home. I give this a high tissue alert, starring Ashley Judd, uh, Edward James Olmos. It follows a dog who travels more than 400 miles to find her owner. Let's is this a, a, is is it a true story? I will look at that up. Okay. <laughs> I don't think it is. <laughs> Take a look, sorry. Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. We're together. We played ball and we played Don't You Shoes. Life with Lucas was the best, but when he wasn't around, I missed him so much. It's that squirrel again. Squirrel, squirrel, squirrel! Bella! I was very far from but home, I but I knew so. Lucas was waiting for me, and I had to go and find him. So wake me up when it's all over. When I'm how many times have we been there? It's, oh my gosh, could you imagine pets? the lost pets? And you know, A Dog's Purpose, that movie, this, the yeah. author who wrote that is the one who wrote this movie. Um, so if that In gives you book. any background. And, and honestly, it's going to be a great family pick. And that's why I put yeah. that as my number one choice. My number two pick is The Upside. Now this is starring Brian Cranston, Kevin Hart, Nicole Kidman, and more following a paralyzed billionaire who strikes up an unlikely friendship with a recently paroled convict who mm. he hires to take care of him. This movie looks great. We're gonna find you someone you like. Let me be your arms and your legs. I love that. All right. Penthouse. You need to wait your turn. Relax, it's not a hold up. Just sign this one, please. How would I sign it? I don't know. Slowly. <sighs> what, don't your arms work? They don't. Which car is yours? All of these to the right. Oh my God. They're not practical. Exactly. <laughs> The soundtrack to that movie is phenomenal. And even though Kevin Hart's not hosting the Oscars, there's Oscar buzz about his performance. Oh, yeah. interesting. So there you go. Okay. Now, my number three pick is Keanu Reeves back on the big screen in replicas about a neuroscientist who violates the law and scientific principles to bring his family members back to life after they die in a car accident. Let's take a look at this. There is a reason human cloning is banned. I'm dead. What if something horrible goes wrong? Something already has. This has got way out of hand. I hope you're ready to go to jail. The experiment's over, Bill. Uh... Mm. 
Keanu Reeves has proven time again. He's box office gold, so we mm. shall see. If you want to see all the releases, check out our Better Weekend blog at BetterCT.com. Now, let's take a look at three things you can do this weekend. Now through Sunday at the Excel Center at the Hartford, uh, in Hartford, you can see the world yeah. of Eva Disney. Eva Zamaris was there live this morning. I actually saw her doing some ice skating. She did a little ice skating <laughs> this morning, right? She did a great right? job. And all of your favorite stories from Disney will come to life on ice as they present to you worlds of enchantment. There's a uh, show tonight, three tomorrow, and two on Sunday. Visit excelcenter.com to buy your tickets. And it's okay to wear your costumes. All the little ones dress their princess dresses. It's very fun. What if you're a little older? Could you well, maybe. wear your costumes? Sure. Absolutely. I'll or wear else a dress. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, a leader in the 90s and early 2000s on Modern Rock Radio, the Verve Pipe. They have a free show tonight at 8 p.m. at the Wolf Den at Mohegan Sun. You may remember The Freshman. That was their number one hit. And frontman Brian Vander Ark starred in Rockstar alongside Jennifer Aniston and Mark Wahlberg. So that's tonight at the Wolf Den, and it's free. And on Sunday, you can lace up your shoes for the Resolution Run 5K at the Connecticut Valley Company in South Windsor. It starts at 8 a.m. It's next to the Brewing Company, where warm food and a cold beer will await you after the run, and the race benefits the South Windsor Parks and Recreation. Now, you guys, there's a ton of events across the state this hmm. weekend, so get out and enjoy. Visit our Better Weekend blog. I've got you connected to events that are free. Some are free with your paid admission. You can go to BetterCT.com. All right, and we're excited because if it's really cold this weekend, we can start thinking about the summer because we have free tickets Absolutely. to the boat show, Renee. Yeah, it's, Ooh. Actually, the, it's next weekend, so we're giving away tickets to the boat show, which is next weekend, January 17th through the 20th, and uh, we're going to be giving you a chance to win. Yeah, you get a family four-pack of tickets so that you can go for free, and again, this is going to be held at Mohegan Sun this year, a be little the, different location. Yeah, it looks like a lot of fun. Be the third caller to one 539 That's one 866 Five three nine nine three seven two. All right, thanks, Renee. Who wants um? Who wants to see more wants, of Better Connecticut right after I this break? I want to see more of Better Connecticut after this break. Me too. Stay with we'll us. Be we'll be right, right back. back.